Hello! Today I'm going to show you how to make this kind of embroidery. You will need fabric, any kind of, but I like this shining fabric for my shisha embroidery. Uh, mirrors, or you can use this large sequence. You can find it in a lot of colors and textures and sizes. Uh, also embroidery floss. This is more easy to find and needles like this, like with uh, a big eye and scissors. First put your fabric into the embroidery hoop like this. The fabric must be secure and tightly. You can pull the fabric like this. And once you got it, then I will treat my needle with this color of embroidery floss. Usually uh, we separate this uh, floss because for embroidery um, most of the times we only use one, one of the threads if you can see. I have a lot of threads in this floss, but for this specific embroidery, I will leave it like this. I will just use it complete. Then I will thread my needle and I will make a knot in the end like this. Then you have to put your, your flows like this and bring your, your sequin here and we will secure it with grossing the stitches first. The first thing you have to do is make a stitch like this. And I will repeat this process now in this place. Crossing my first stitch. Like this. Then the next point is here. Don't make these stitches to separate. We want the Close uh, like this near, like every stitch must be near of, of the other. Now my next point is here, and I will cross my stitch. Here. Now I have these foundation stitches and I will repeat it in 45 um, degrees angles in every, starting from every 
corner, you can say like this. I will start at this point and I will cross to the opposite point. No, here, this, this will be the opposite. So I will cross it like this and I will put my needle here. Then I will go with my needle in the next, next uh, point. In every extreme of my stitches I will do the same. Now I will start with this and I will um, make my I have a knot here uh -huh. so the next in the opposite point If you can see my first foundation stitches was four and I will make four now again my next point starting point is this and I will cross it to the opposite again you have to cross to the opposite side starting from every Point. This is my last one. As I told you before, um, my first foundation stitches it was uh, four, and now I make again four, and I have this kind of of a star. It's beautiful from now on, but we will finish it. Once you have your foundation stitches like this with your star you have to put your needle from from the bottom like this and after that I will I will throw my needle inside my foundation stitches and I will get uh, some kind of a not here if you can see and the next is I will make a stitch like this but I will leave this floss I will leave it under my needle so this will give me my next knot and this is the first step I will repeat it I will repeat sorry this step all around my sequin again I will throw my needle from here like this and now I will put my needle inside my first knot and I will make the same stitch and I will go over my floss with my needle and that will give me my next knot and again repeat the process like this now again inside my last knot and I will make this stitch over my floss again and I have my, my next knot I will repeat this all around my sequin or my mirror to cover it all
all around it. Once you finish it in your last stitch, you have to insert your needle in the first knot you got here to close your uh, chain embroidery. Now I will I will make a round chain using this this kind of stitch. I only have to go over my floss like this and I have my first stitch. For the next one is the same. I will make a round like this, sorry, like this and I'm going with my needle over this round floss over it, over my floss and I have my next chain and I will repeat the same process all over around like this where I finished and I will close it with my last one And at the end, I will insert my needle in my first chain and make a knot under your fabric to secure it. And that's it. After that, you can use this kind of simple stitches to make a, some embroidery ornaments here. And that's it.